Hello. Uh, I'd now like to spend a few minutes talking more directly about uh, our reinsurance program and your participation in it. First of all, it's important for me to make clear to you that we value your participation greatly. This program began in 2000, and since then it's continued strongly to your benefit and to ours. We've paid you approximately $435 million over those uh, about 12 years, and we have not uh, recorded a loss on the reinsurance program. And it's also important to note that for many years before this particular reinsurance program began in 2000, we had many years of other forms of reinsurance for which there was never a loss presented to the reinsurance panel either. As we look at the reinsurance program we have, we were very pleased with the participation. We're often oversubscribed. We have the benefit of very long-standing relationships with the vast majority of our reinsurance panel. Uh, nearly 90% had been on the program since its inception, and over 90% had been on the program for the last number of years. It's our intention to continue to nurture those relationships because we do see this not as a commodity, but as an important relationship. That's why we invest annually in our visits to you, why we share information that seems relevant as it occurs, and why we have afforded and will continue to afford you the opportunity to come to our nuclear plants to see firsthand the strength of the safety practices, the commitment of the individuals, and the real dedication to excellence in operation and safety. Let me talk for a moment about the year 2011 and the events that transpired. Fukushima, the Virginia earthquake near the North Anna nuclear plant, and obviously the Crystal River claim which is still ongoing. You're obviously interested in the outcome of that uh, claim in view of the media uh, that's been very active on that topic. What I can tell you is that Neil is very actively investigating that claim. We understand the obligations and the protocol that we have to share with you in the event that we determine the claim is covered and if it were to come to approximately uh, half or more of the attachment point in the current reinsurance. The industry, of course, has taken meaningful steps through organizations such as INPO, Institute of Nuclear Power Operations, WANO, the World Association of Nuclear Operators, and NEI, Nuclear Energy Institute, all of whom have spent a great deal of time and energy this year dealing with the aftermath of particularly Fukushima and the North Anna earthquake. As a result of those actions and ongoing steps, the risk that uh, we at Neil and you through the reinsurance program have are actually less than what they were before those events happened because the lessons learned have been taken to heart from those events. The nuclear industry is committed to safety, is committed to strong operation, and all those things really redound to your benefit in the risk that you bear through our reinsurance program. Uh, it is our intention to continue to uh, maintain this reinsurance program. Uh, the relationship we have with you is very important. Uh, we realize it's also important that we maintain an, uh, a good flow of information so that you understand where we are, what the industry and Neil are doing to mitigate your risks, and that the diversification of this type of risk uh, is a very strong uh, asset to you and as you undertake your uh, company-wide reinsurance participations. We thank you for your time and your effort and your interest and support of Neil, and we look forward to that in many years to come.